Hey friends, it's Jamie here with Milk Allergy Mom, where we make allergy life less stressful and a whole lot better. And as part of that, we share recipes that we think are super tasty and simple, allergy friendly and kid approved. And today I have my kiddos helping me make some stovetop hot chocolate that is of course dairy free we have our first snow outside you guys what is up it's like veterans day today happy veterans day to all our veteran friends out there thank you for your service and we just got home from a uh, ceremony and we are cold and it is snowing and it is time for hot cocoa we are ready to go on this um, I think my kids are waiting for me to pour the milk in and get this going so we have made the base for the hot chocolate real simple just some cocoa powder and sugar and it is time to add the milk in so I'm going to do that now with you guys uh, we have the recipe at Milk Allergy Mom. I will link you over to that in just a second. Just a quick tip on this one. You just want to pay attention to the dairy-free milk that you are using. We like to use uh, unsweetened almond milk, but then some milks that people grab are going to be quite sweet. So just keep that in mind when you're making your hot cocoa. Uh, this calls for equal parts cocoa powder and sugar. But if you happen to have a sweetened milk, you may want to lessen the sugar in your hot cocoa so it doesn't end up too sweet. Me personally, I don't like it really sweet. But and then also my kids end up doing things like adding whipped cream on top. So of course that's going to add to the sweetness too. So when we put these recipes at Milk Allergy Mom and it calls for dairy-free milk, I'm usually going for an unsweetened milk that we can doctor up ourselves. But I know sometimes you guys grab the sweetened milk when you're out and about and so just wanted to give you that heads up. We're going to top this with some whipped cream, some sprinkles. We're going to get a new picture and we are going to enjoy our first stove top hot chocolate for the season. This is a great recipe to serve up to guests. Um, you're not using up chocolate chips or anything precious like that. It's literally just the cocoa powder, the sugar, a couple other special ingredients. And we're going to get you guys the recipe. And we are hoping that you are staying warm today and having a good day yourselves. If you love hot chocolate, be sure to leave a comment. Let us know if you are a hot chocolate drinker. And if you have not, Given your kids dairy-free hot chocolate yet, what are you waiting for? Because it is super yummy and it's one of my kids' favorite things to do in the winter. So we hope you guys get to try it and we hope you have a great day. This is Jamie reminding allergy parents everywhere we are in this together and we'll talk to you soon.